What's up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Destroyer, and welcome back to Junkyard Truck. This is episode number six. This is actually about the third time I've tried recording this video because the game keeps crashing. I think we're due for a, a patch or something, and uh, the, the truck's running like a freaking dog, too. I don't know what's going on with it, but uh, yeah, I think this game needs an update or a bit of a patch. But uh, in today's video, I would like to buy some new shoes for the, for the truck. Um, and I kind of figured, I'm not sure how to get the actual tires off the wheels. I know there's, we've got these changes over here, but I think I'd rather just buy some new, new wheels as well. So, I mean, I've got about ooh, 15 grand at home. So I was just thinking about getting the cheapest wheels we can. They're a hundred and, oh, they're a hundred too. I assume they're all the same size, so <laughs> that doesn't matter. We've got beadlock wheels. Double bead locks for 600 bucks. Um, I think we might grab the eight spokes. Hmm. I don't know if it really matters, to be honest. So, I want to do that. Um, now, actual tires, I want to get a balanced tire. So, if we have a quick look at the catalog here. Because I was thinking about the Nitro M1000s there with the six star mud. Three rock and the four durability, but I lo I want like I said a balanced wheel. So the TS TSX is there in the right hand side. Uh, it's three six six uh, three five five five. So I think I'm gonna grab them, and I think they're like five hundred bucks. Yeah, five hundred bucks each. So we'll grab them. Now I know we got a a crowbar, but I. When I tried to do anything with the crowbar and the wheel. Oh, there we go. Boom. Uh, yeah, it's... They didn't do anything, basically, so... I thought I'll just get some new wheels as well. I got the money. Like I said, I got about 15k. You know, I just spent a shit ton of money then, but that's fine. Got plenty left at home. Because I've just been, uh... Come on. Just been playing poker. And, uh, been winning five, six grand. Dude. Why aren't you playing ball, bro? There we go. Yeah, five or six grand each time I was playing poker. So it's too easy. It's too easy to make money in this game, but I kind of like that. One reason I stopped playing Mon Bazoo is because the grind was just too much, man. Like, <laughs> what was it? 200 bucks per maple syrup freaking barrel? Like, that's just bullshit, man. You have to make too many of them. Where's my wheel gone? Is it rolled off somewhere? Yeah, <laughs> there it is. What the? Come back here, you little bitch. Right, so yeah, the plan in this video is obviously get these fitted. Um, I also want to, because if you watched the last video, I tried to do a mission and none of them seemed to be working. Uh, there were no waypoints to tell me where things were. Like, for example, this guy down here, he... Um, he wants me to do something at the water, something or other. Can't even remember. But um, point is, none of the uh, missions were working. No waypoints were showing up. I didn't know where to go. I didn't know what to do. So I thought, screw that. Um, like I said, new tires, new wheels. And then we're going to go, because I've had a little look. I st I'm not 100% sure where he is, but that guy with the moonshine or shows you how to teaches you how to make moon moonshine. I, uh, I have a fair idea on where he is. I'm not exactly sure. He's down there somewhere. But I would like to get that going as well. Because off camera, I did make my first brew. Uh, six cornmeal, two sugar, and one yeast. Uh, that's the recipe I saw on the internet. And that looked like the uh, the correct recipe. There's a few out there, but um, apparently they're wrong. Well, not wrong. Not necessarily wrong, but it's not the best moonshine you can uh, you can make. So, do you, will you just come off now? There we go. Alright. I'm assuming you might be worth a few, Bob, but I'll just keep you over there for now. The truck... No, don't go back on, you silly bitch. Come here. Alright. Yeah, I'm assuming I can sell them. I don't, don't see why I can't. Um, I wouldn't recommend doing this in real life. <laughs> 
you know, you have your truck up on blocks, mate. Now, I, I noticed there is a hoist lift there, but I can't seem to interact with it. So I think it probably costs money. And, you know, I know we're not broke or struggling at the moment for money, but I uh, don't really want to spend money on something like that when I could probably just glitch them on. Isn't that a beautiful sight? <laughs> I could probably just glitch them on like this, so. Let's see. Hey. Green tick, yeah, see? Easy enough. Cool. So these, this will obviously help with uh, driving in the mud, even rock. Uh, it's only three stars on the road, but meh, doesn't really matter. I don't think we're going to be doing too much driving on the road with missions anyway. They all seem to be, you know, <laughs> outback driving and stuff like that. Come on. Well, not outback, you know what I mean, like 4x4. Four four. Dude, why don't you want to go, go on? Do I have to lean into you? Come on. Am I too... Like, it'll give me a tick and then it'll disappear. There we go. Jeez, it's hard work, mate. Yeah, so uh, I can't remember who the devs are for this game, but... Yeah. Come on, get a patch out. Because I uh, honestly didn't think I'll be recording this video today. And fair enough, like, I understand it would be pretty hard developing a video game and... All that sort of stuff, but... People like me, where we don't really have much time to record, is really annoying... And, you know, it almost makes me want to just give up on the game, you know. Because you get all this stuff done and then the game just crashes. It's like, really? Then you have to do it all over again, so. And having said that, I am actually going to save the game right now. <laughs> so I don't have to do that again. Actually, I should probably tighten the wheels down, but... Ah, oh, yeah, I'll do that. But at least then I won't have to buy the tyres and wheels again. So we'll get these on. Easy peasy. Alright, definitely tight. They don't look like they're f fully tight, but hmm. I know it costs 50 bucks to uh, to save the game here, but I actually did find other... Actually, nah, I'll save it here just in case it crashes again. Alright, there's 50 bucks down the drain. But there are a couple of save points in the game apart from your home. Um, so obviously it costs 50 bucks to save it there, but if you go to the junkyard... And somewhere else, I can't remember the other location, but you can actually save your game on the computer there for free. So, now, what time is it? Okay, five past... Well, sorry, 20 past five, not five past. Because, um, like I said, I think I have an idea on where that guy is for Moonshine. Um, down here somewhere. I have a feeling he is. My tyres are there, my old ones, but that's fine. I don't really care about them right this moment. It's somewhere down here, I think. Now, I've never been down here. I think in the last... No, it wasn't the last episode. I think I was playing off camera. I ended up down a, um, a dirt road. But, uh, yeah. I, the, the truck was struggling and I had to get it towed. So, yeah, I think it's down here. Because I would pull up the map, but it's obviously going to cover the screen and I won't be able to see so I, th I think this is it yeah 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 see this house this is that old dude's place and apparently he's going to teach us how to make moonshine or something like that I don't know but alright yo are you the guy you look like a guy moonshine you say yeah I don't make that stuff anymore sit down let me tell you a story you got pretty man took out a college loan. Can I sit in? But I never went to college. Well, they started asking for the money. What the hell is I this? I them I used the money to build a nuclear bomb. What the? And that I'd appreciate it if they stopped calling. Well, they stopped calling, so it's been sitting here since then, and I should probably get rid of it. Maybe you can haul it to the dump for me. But, uh, do it at night so nobody sees you. Do that, and I'll tell you how to make your own moonshine. Okay. What did I tell you about moonshine? No. Moonshine? That's, that's not even what I'm doing out here, lady. <laughs> Let me 
Have you got an empty house? You do. There's some gum boots though. So we have to get rid of this nuclear bomb. Uh, how heavy is that? Are we going to be able to haul this with our current config? I don't know. We might need the V8 for this. I have no idea. Wow, that's heavy. Look at the truck just drop. Wow. Okay. Uh, well, it's night time. Oh, hey, look at that. It's a beautiful sight. A waypoint. Okay, so that's it. What about moonshine and shit, dude? What's this? Bucket lid. Oh. Do I take these? I don't know. Do I? Nah, screw it. I don't know where the actual buckets are, but looks like we've got two bucket lids. The lighting is really weird in this game. Odd. Anyway. Alright, well, it's 6.30. Is that late enough? Wait. Did that waypoint just disappear? Because I picked up a bucket lid? You kidding me, game? How am I supposed to... Know? Dude, where am I... Where am I taking this shit? Yo. What the hell are you holding, by the way? Wait, let me, uh... If I drop them, will the waypoint come back? <laughs> what? This is ridiculous. I don't even know where I'm supposed to put it. Am I, am I supposed to take it to the junkyard? This is going to be super heavy. It's at a thousand meters that way. So if we open up the map, maybe we have to take it to the, uh, the dump. Actually, that would make more sense. Not the junkyard, the dump. Which is where we sell those uh, garbage bags. Alright. Oh yeah, she's sluggish. Come on, girl. Oh dear. It's going to take me half an hour to get there. And why did that waypoint disappear? I'm just trying to think, like, that's why I'm silent at the moment. <laughs> I'm trying to think on why... Oh, hang on. Get up! Oh my god. Um... Yeah, I'm wondering why that waypoint disappeared. Is... is are there a few bugs in this game that need ironed out? Do we need a patch? A hot fix? I don't know. I'm only guessing here, I have no idea. Like I said, it has crashed like three times for me. This is the furthest I've got so far. Uh, how's our fuel? The fuel's fine. Oh, I found out about that... That truck there too, that race. It's actually apparently quite easy. So, you can do it straight away. You don't have to, uh... Drop a V8 in, uh, in, into your car or your truck first before you do the race. Apparently it's quite easy. And it, there are different stages, I believe, as well. But that's something we can maybe have a look at later on in the video. Um, now if I turn left here, I know there's no waypoints, so this might be a complete waste of time, but, hmm. I'm pretty sure it's heading towards the dump. Yeah. Wow, this is so heavy, I can't even get up that. Alright, let's try with a running, a running start. Alright, go. This is stupid. Okay, right. I'm just gonna put that there. It's obviously not too heavy to lift, <laughs> so I don't know why he had trouble. Actually, let me try putting it in that. Why not, eh? The game won't let me do what I'm supposed to be doing. Actually, I don't even know if it's supposed to come here, to be honest, but... Don't be a prick. Suck my... The city is gonna be all over me with this. <laughs> Give me some money for it. Okay. Just put the fucking bags in a receptacle. Alright. So, because that's part of an actual mission. I can't sell it. Fair enough. Uh, well, yeah. I don't know. There's some junk. There's some more junk. Wait. 
It'd be funny if I could actually sell that here. Keep bringing these bags, okay? <laughs> do I get a hundred for it? I do. Wow, that is really convenient. It's like the game feels bad for me. It's like, ah, oh, ah, oh, yeah, yeah. We're sorry. We'll give you some. We'll give you a couple of hundred bucks. Uh, by the way, dude, these are not bags. The city is gonna be all over me with this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what they all say. Is this even where you... Like, if you play this, if you've done this mission, is this where you bring the nuke? Okay, frame rates are dropping like crazy all of a sudden. Fix your game! And I'm back. Yes, that's right. It's been about a good week since I played this game. Um, I literally just got fed up with it. It kept crashing, the frame rates kept dropping, it was taking a massive tanking. So I thought, you know what, it's wasting my time right now. I played a little little bit more my summer car, and I thought I'd come back to this. I have uh, went back into town and retrieved my old tires and wheels there, as you can see. But also off camera, I uh, grabbed all the parts of the V8 engine. Now, I don't know if there is a guide for this online. I have no idea. I haven't really looked, to be honest. But um, I figured, you know, this is a video game. It should hold my hand a little. And uh, if I see a green tick, I know I'm just going to put it in there. So I've mounted the block onto this thing i think i was calling it a hoist but it's not really a hoist is it you can't really i don't know if this can go up and down i'm not i'm not sure oh it's raining great uh anyway so i've decided to <laughs> for the rest of this video is to build this there we go i think i want to be like that like i said i have no idea what i'm doing um i'm just going to put the pistons in look for a green tick okay um I will try and put them in order, like one, two, three, four. Now, I think two goes on the other side, doesn't it, in a V8? Yeah. There's no ticks there, so. Oh, cool. There we go. <laughs> oh, man. The beauty of not knowing what the hell you're doing. But like I said, it's a video game. It probably won't get too, too technical. Um, there we go. And I don't know what's going on with the truck at the moment. It can't even... Uh, it's like it, there's zero power in it. Um, do you go there? Apparently. Like a tiny little incline and the truck wouldn't even get up it. It would just want to roll backwards again. And I'm just like, what the hell? So that's why I've decided to uh, buy all the V8 parts, build this, and then hopefully get some more power. So we can, can, can continue on with the game a little bit. Whoops. Because if I have a look at the missions here, actually, by the way, GG on my behalf. If I want to have the waypoint show up, all I gotta do is click on this little diamond. So, uh, yeah, GG for me on that one. Can't believe I gapped on that. But if we have a look here, because the first half of this video, I was trying to find out where to get rid of the nuclear bomb. Right here. And apparently, it's been completed. So, local dump, and it even said dead dump, because I wasn't even sure <laughs> where to put it, but there we go, and the moon, moonshine guy, Jigs, we've already spoken to him, so that's all good. Um, I just wanted to quickly show that. So yeah, GG on my behalf. At least now I know how to get waypoints back up if I do lose them. So anyway, so pistons are in. Like I said, I don't know what sort of order this will go in. Now this camshaft, I'm assuming, will go here. Waiting for a tick. Okay, there we go. Now, do we have any bolts for you? We do. All right. Okay, just the one, I think. Must be. I don't know. Uh, once it's fully assembled, I will go over it with the with the ratchet just to see if I've missed any bolts. But no, I don't want the flywheel yet. I want the crankshaft. Thank you very much. You go. Yeah. Okay. Do you have any bolts? No? Okay. <laughs> right, yes, yeah, so like I said, I have no idea about order. I don't know what goes next. Um, I think if, this will be where the timing go, goes, yeah? Like the timing chain and stuff. Uh, we've got a fan. Timing gear. I'm assuming that has to go on first somewhere. Like, I am a complete noob when it comes to engines and stuff like that. Uh, personally, in real life, I am more a, more, more of, hang on, I just want to, more of a bike guy. Wait. Oh, that was already 
tight for me. Interesting. I'm more of a bike guy in real life. You know, like MotoGP, that sort of thing. Okay, you go there. Right. <laughs> so yeah, I'm more, I'm more into bikes and stuff, so I know a bit more about bikes than cars. That's what I'm trying to say. Okay, do you go on yet? I have so many questions. Right. Uh, what's that distributor? I might move that so I can see it properly. Uh, timing cover. Water pump. Okay. So that was in order. Cool. Kind of, I guess. I don't know. If you're watching this and you know a lot about V8 engines or engines in general, probably screaming at your monitor or whatever you're watching on right now, but hey, I don't know. Simple as that. And I'm not going to pretend to know, you know. I'm not going to be like, oh yeah, I know all about this shit when I don't. So, at least I'm open and honest. Do you go here? Maybe the flywheel goes on the other end. I don't know. I keep forgetting that you can actually rotate this thing as well. Uh, actually, the oil pan will go there, will it not? Yeah, okay. Assuming we've got some screws here. Now, these side screws, I think they're for the mount, aren't they? Like, when you mount them into the engine bay. They were already down. Hmm. I don't know. There we go. We've got three here. What the? That bolt disappeared. Where did that go? One. Two. Move that. There we go. Now I can see a bit better. Ah, oh, was it? Oh. Yeah. Hang on. I should probably take that off, yeah. I forgot the pistons need, uh... Bolting down, I think. <laughs> uh, the life of an engine noob. Alright. Let me... Why you no come off, bro? Is it because of... No. Oh. Right. I don't know. Of course, yeah. There we go. Ooh, two for one. Nice. Okay, that's down, that's down, that's... Down. Right. Okay. Um, if you've built this V8 engine in this game, let me know how realistic it is. Or realistic, maybe. Um, yeah, because I'm just curious about that. The sort of... The... What's the word I'm looking for? I suppose just how realistic the game is when it comes to building engines and stuff. Compared to real life, because... Like I said, I have no idea. Okay, that's down. Just want to... Make sure they're all down. So I don't want any loose bolts. Once she's mounted... Mounted in the uh, engine bay. Okay, I think that's it. Nothing else seems to want to go down. Alright. Now I put the oil pan back on. Yeah. Uh, Scoozy. There we go. Why would it give me a green tick when I'm like... Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Video games, bro. Video games for the win. So I'm assuming there's only four bolts for this oil pan. Sump, whatever you want to call it. I always wonder why things have different names, you know. Like, it's the same thing, but it's two different names. Oil sump, oil pan. I don't know. Right. Okay. Like I said, I'm probably doing this way out of order, but hey-ho. That's life. Okay, those things, uh, uh, okay, <laughs> intake manifold, torque converter, carb alternator, crank pull, E, that'll be here somewhere, wouldn't it? Oop, there we go, I'm assuming that's got some screws or some bolts, just one in the middle. 
Okay. Uh, flywheel and all that. that. That might go on the other end. I like it how we can just glitch it through, though. Uh. Hadouken. Okay. At least they're easy to see, these bolts. And I figured after this has been assembled, we'll have the fun of uh, installing the engine itself. Um, now, having a look at this, they're obviously the mounting screws, so there's four of them. So I'm assuming there's four on the old uh, Toyota V4, or four-cylinder, that we've got out there. Okay. Uh, okay, I suppose the timing cover would be next, unless there's anything else to put in there. I don't know. No? You don't want to... Okay. Yeah, see, like, my order is way out of whack here. But, at least you can... install parts through different parts. Oh, I forgot to screw down the, uh... What is that, the water pump? Okay. Is that it for this uh, timing cover? Is there only two screws? That seems like it's not enough. I thought maybe four. Okay, lean into the engine. Aha, there you are. I thought two seemed too little. <laughs> Uno, dos... Three and quattro. Okay, okay. Right. Right. Okay. Uh, <laughs> now, these things here. Wait, what is this? Manifold. You, I assume... Do these go on the sides? Whoa. Stand up. Because there's a driver side and a passenger side on this, I think. Yeah, driver. So, looking at that, this will be the driver side, yeah? I have no idea where this goes. <laughs> Wrong orientation, maybe? Do I have to flip it? Let me try, uh... Turning this sucker around, maybe like that, yeah. I have no idea where this thing goes. No, I do not. Where does this go? Hello. Hello. Um, now, driver's side of this engine, I think, uh, would be pistons 1 to... F well, I'll say 1 to 4, but... Oh, hang on. Does that go sort of up the top, maybe? Wait, what? When did that fall out? You absolute monger. Get back in there. Dude. <laughs> Come on. Oh, don't tell me I have to take the oil pan out again and stuff. Actually, I will. I could have sworn I tightened everything down with the pistons. Clearly not. Oh, is that because this is connected to everything else? No. Just gotta find the right pixel. Right. Just wanna double check these. Oh. How did I miss them in the first place? The first place, first time. Dude, I can't get any closer. Okay, they're the mounting screws. So, I mean, I suppose it doesn't matter if you tighten down the mounting screws early, like now. But okay. Uh, 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Where's. Oh, no, that. There it is. Is that it? Oh, there it is, you son of a bitch. That looks... Yeah, I was going to say, that's not bolted down. Right, so that should be done now, yeah? Fingers crossed. Now, where's me pan gone? <laughs> no, 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 no. Don't do that. Okay. Yeah, so this is uh, an experience. I mean, if I had a build guide, it'd be much easier. Like I said, there might be one out there. But I haven't really looked for one. Right. Because I'm assuming there's uh, people playing this game that know about engines and all that in real life. So that is, <laughs> you know, they know what order things go in and yada, yada, yada. Right. Okay. Now... Come on. Wow. Look at that. It's possessed. And I can't grab it. So yeah, cool. Um Ah, hang on. Hmm. Let me try saving it. Actually. Because it thinks it's on here still, doesn't it? I swear I had the worst luck with this game. Okay, so I saved the game, got out of it, got back into it, and uh, the engine's still here. Ah, right, I can just grab it now. At least I can grab it. I couldn't uh, interact with it before. Alright, so you go there. Can I... Dude, is that poking out the other side? Come on, bro. <laughs> I mean... What the? Right, okay. Dude. Now I'm outside. Come here. <laughs> I love video games when that... Does stupid shit like this. Just... Come here. Come here. Come here. Can I... Okay. Well, that was an experience, wasn't it? Okay. Uh... I guess to come back a touch. There we go. Alright, let's try that again. I don't know how that happened, to be honest. Um... Yeah, I guess we'll... Just try and forget that ever happened. Alright, now my shit's gone all over the joint. Um, yeah. <laughs> I still don't know where these go. Somebody help me. I should really stream this. You know, and anyone in chat that knows about V8 engines, they can help me out. Oh, man. Do these go here? Did I go above? I don't know. Because I figured once I've got this built, drop her in the truck and then we'll have a lot more power and be able to get, you know, small inclines. Because <laughs> I want to do more with this game. Ah, oh, man. Okay, I'm going to try and rotate that. Okay. Uh, hmm. Because I don't want to, uh, I don't want to glitch the engine into the wall and stuff again. Hang on a minute. Oh, no. Yeah. All I want, all I'm looking for right now is a green tick. Just a little green tick. That's all I want. Oh my god, look at all my money. Bro. 
Bro, bro, bro. Come on. I did have my money in a neat pile over here. But it's all over the joint now. I bet you I've lost some too. Oh dear. Um, because I think I had more rolls than that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Dude, my cornmeal's all over the joint. My cram. My spider bait. It's, it's just, it's all gone. <laughs> Actually, I had way more than that. What the hell, game? Don't tell me you've glitched it outside. Dude. There's a fridge. Drop it. Oh my god. Now the game's stealing from me. <laughs> Come on, bro. Oh. There's two of them. That might... That might be it. Uh... Is there four... Dude, just... There we go. Four, four... Five grand. At least I didn't lose the big one. <laughs> I think that might be it. I'm, I can't remember. That looks about right, money-wise. Hmm. Still got 1,600 on me. Uh, yeah, what's that? What the hell is that? Looks like DVD box sets or something. But uh, what I've decided to do is is actually end this episode here. I might look up, see if, on the internet, see if there is a guide for the engine build, the V8 engine build. Uh, if you know in the comments, let me know. Um, I am going to take a little bit of time off this game as well, because it is just, it's taken a lot of time. So, oh my god. Literally, so, you know... The time wasted with this, I could be using it, you know, recording more of my summer car and some other games like that. So, I might take another couple of days off this, uh, see if anyone is, if anyone knows any tips or whatever with this engine build, uh, let me know to order maybe, I don't know. I, but I will look at it, I'll have a look on the internet and see if there are any sort of guides or anything like that. There might, might even be some videos with people building this engine. And, uh, yeah, so... But have a little look at that. But yeah, I'm going to leave this episode here. It's obviously a two-parter, but one episode. Uh, that's the beauty of editing. I can just uh, put it all together. And it was look like I've just been playing the whole time. But yeah, let me know if you've been having any problems with this game, if you're playing it. Uh, let me know if you want to see a full series of this once again. Because uh, I do ask the question most videos, but people don't really answer me. Um, so it's kind of like you're talking to yourself, you know. Well, I am talking to myself in a sense technically but uh but yeah anyway let me know if you want to see a full series got any tips with the engines and whatnot um or maybe even sort of like with the truck to get some more power in her maybe i could maybe uh what do you call it install a, a turbo or something like that i don't know thoughts and tips tricks anything like that would be much appreciated but if you enjoyed this video make sure to give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel for more content make sure to hit that notification bell so you are notified of every time i upload a video and i'll catch you in episode seven Adios.